Hello, welcome to Apichip YouTube channel. Today we are going to check out a clipboard manager called Messi. This clipboard manager is lightweight, open source, and completely free to use. To download this app, go to this URL messi.app. We will also make sure to put the URL in the description of this YouTube video. Once you are on this website, click on the download now button. When you click on the download button, this opens up a pop-up asking you to donate an amount. You can simply type zero here because this is a free tool. So if you type zero, you don't have to pay anything. Click on add to cart. Now you have to enter an email address over here. You can type any email address over here. Click on get button. It seems we have already added this email address, so I'm going to close this. Go back and open start the process again. Again, I will type zero as a fair amount. Next, I'm going to type my email something random which is not used on this website. And now I can see click here to visit your content. I will click on this button. This will start the download. So I'll select the right folder and download the file. Once the file is downloaded, I can click on the downloads icon. Click on this. It will say the file is not commonly downloaded. I'll say download this file. Once it is downloaded, I'll again click on the downloads button. Click on the icon which will automatically open the finder window with the folder containing this downloaded file. I can now take this messy.app file and drag and drop it into the applications folder in my finder. Also, if you don't trust, because we saw a warning here that this could be a suspicious file, do you want to download it or not? Alternatively, you can also, if you don't trust the direct download link, you can also go to the website and click on this Get an App Store button, which will automatically open App Store. And you can download the app from here, but the problem is the app is paid over here. You will need to pay a certain amount to download the app from here. Once you've copied the application, uh, the app, downloaded app into the applications folder, if you now go to Launchpad and type Messi over here, you will see that it is successfully installed. I will click on this icon to start this app. And now it is going to ask, you know, are you sure you want to open it? I will say yes, open it please. When the app is open, it will be visible as this icon in my top navigation bar like this. Whenever I click on this icon, I can see certain options. Now. Because this is a clipboard manager, if I start copying stuff, so I'm going to select manager no here and then I'm going to select the option edit copy. Now I'm also going to copy right click on maybe this uh, and rev over here, right click and say copy. I can also open some page, right click and say copy image. Now I've just now copied three different pieces of content. So if I click on this icon now, I can see that manager no and rev and Google are now copied to my clipboard and kept here. So let's say the last copied item was, was this Google logo. So now if I want to look at my clipboard history and I want to copy manager no instead, I can simply click on this icon and either press command 3 shortcut as it is shown here or I can simply click on this item and then this will copy that particular item to be pasted on the clipboard. So now if I click on this text box over here and simply type command V which will paste whatever it is on my clipboard, I can see that now manager no is copied. So I can try to copy a little bit more stuff. Let's say I want to copy this review. Now I want to copy the description of Messi. Now I want to let's say copy the name of the developer. 
and let's say I want to copy the languages that are supported. And let's say I want to copy this developer data warning over here. Every time I copy something and then click on this messy icon, I will see that all of these items are actually copied on the clipboard manager app. So let's say now I need to paste the name of the developer somewhere. I can simply click on this messy icon. Check out the item that I want to paste. In this case, I want to paste the developer name. And when I click on it, now this item gets copied to the clipboard and is again shown here at the top. So the most recently copied item is always shown at the top of this list. Now I have the developer name in my clipboard. So if I go to Google and want to type the developer name, I can simply say edit paste and I will now be able to see the name of the developer. That's all that Messi does, but it's very lightweight. It does it really well. And it is completely free to use. You can also go to pre preferences window and you can select that this tool always launches as login. You can set certain keyboard shortcuts. You can also say paste without formatting or with formatting. What sort of, you know, copied content should be stored. This includes files, images and text. Uh, how many items to store. So you can, you know, sometimes I usually set this to 1000. How does messy looks? So I think this is. This wasn't saved, but I can manually take this up to some other, other number. Appearance, pins. Pins are essentially, you know, even over here, let's say there's certain text that I want to refer to very frequently. Uh, I can simply add a pin to that particular item. I can ignore certain items and I can set some advanced options that I want to. That's all about Messi. I hope you found this video useful. If you like this video, please like this channel and also don't forget to subscribe to it. Thank you very much for visiting Appy Chip today. Hope you have a nice day.